him? Yeah. I know him. It's going to take a while. It happened years ago. Did you know there are three kind of aces? Those who seek strength, those who live for pride, and those who can read the tide of battle. Those are the three. And him? He was a fighter pilot they called Solo Wing Pixie. This man was his buddy. It was a cold and snowy day. And what is peace? Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and welcome to my the first video of my Ace Combat Zero commentary playthrough. So uh, first of all, I'm once again using the, the emulator to play this game. This game was already only released on the PlayStation 2 and um, my settings will be in the in the description of the video. Uh, also the, the version of the emulator that I'm using to uh, run this game, which it does, ru it does run pretty damn well. And uh, all the settings will be in the description of this video and also in all the next upcoming videos of this series as well. So, Ace Combat Zero came out in 2006 when I was, uh, when I was 11 years old. And like I mentioned in my Ace Combat 5 playthrough, I played Zero before I played Ace Combat 5. I had no idea that they were making Ace Combat, uh, Ace Combat 5. I thought they made Ace Combat 4 and then Ace Combat Zero. My English was already, was already kind of kind of good at, at that time, so I couldn't understand most of it as I played through the game. And unlike Ace Combat 5, the mission design of this game, the level design, is a lot more lenient, is a, is a lot more focused towards action than the storytelling, right? The thing that I disliked about Ace Combat 5, like I mentioned, is, is the mission design. This game, I, I always felt when I played for the first time, that it was a different game, it was more action, and immediately it was a lot more appealing to me than uh, than Ace Combat 5. And after Ace Combat 4, which which is my favorite Ace Combat game, comes this game actually. The Ace Combat 0 is my top 2 Ace Combat game. And it has always been like that. Every time I replay this game, it still feels really damn good. Sure, it does feel a little rushed sometimes, especially uh, around mission uh, 12 or 13 when PJ shows up. It feels like they are just they put a couple of missions there, you know, like they kind of feel very fillerish. Uh, but then, but then the pace comes back up. But most most of the game feels really good to play, right? It's a lot of action, a lot of decision making, not not a lot of waiting. If there's any at all, maybe there is a little bit. I don't remember right now. But I always liked how this game is is a lot more leaning towards that. This game started things that 
it's still pretty cool these days. I mean, the first one that comes in my mind is the the Squadron Rangers, right? When the when the Belkin Squadron show up, they have their own little dialogue, their own cutscene. They do like little crazy maneuvers and all, and you, you see their name and their symbols. You know, you just you just feel the the threat that they are coming up, right? That they are the boss of the game, and and that always felt amazing to me, right? When they show up and still do. It's one of the charms of this game. But if there's one thing I don't like about it, it's actually how this game has the, the Aces styles, right? It has Knight, uh, Mercenary, and Soldier, right? Depending on which route you are, it will change which Balkan Squadron you're gonna fight. And it, it, it will also change the cutscene that you're gonna get later, right? Which are cutscenes from the characters that are part of the squadron that you just uh, destroyed. So, for this playthrough, I am actually going to record every different thing that comes up in uh, regarding the squadrons, right? For example, when we get to mission three, we're going to fight the first one. And I'm going to record which squadron shows up on mercenary style and then soldier and then knight. All of that in the same video. I'm not going to record the entire mission. I'm just going to record the, the boss itself, right? The fight itself. So I think the, this this save file is on Mercenary, if I'm not mistaken. So first off, you're going to see me playing through the mission. And then I'm going to fight the, the Belkin Squadron that shows up in the Mercenary. And once I'm done uh, destroying the squadron, I'm going to switch to the, the squadron that shows up on Soldier and then on Knight. And then we're going to wrap up the video, right? Because I don't want to record each video for like each mission. You know, I, I want to have one video that shows up all the major differences that happen in the in that mission depending on which a style you're at and i'm also going to do that for the the two misses in this game where you get to choose the the operation you know the, the the alpha beta theta like mars jupiter whatever i think there's only like a couple of missions right that are that you can choose the the operation and that that includes the cutscenes as well right it the the cutscene that shows up is is based upon which squadron you fought so I don't, I don't know if in mission three there's like one at the end or it's mission four but mainly every every like major differences that happen depending on which style you are i'm gonna include them at the same video so we can have you know like the full playthrough of it without having to make different videos from it there are some cutscenes that are a, a little different depending on what style you're at like the for, for the, the first one from pixie uh, he kind of says a few different things, but in the end, he's he wants to he wants to mean the same thing. So those those cutscenes, I'm just gonna re record uh, only one. Like it, it's probably going to be mercenary because that that's the style that I'm at right now. I'm only gonna include the the cutscenes that uh, from the different uh, from the different characters and all, and the fights and the missions that have different uh, operations in it. I feel like I'm forgetting something, but if I remember, I'm just gonna say later on. So. Uh, you have to play on special new game in this, so you can play on Ace Difficult, which, as you know, the same as 5 and 4. If you get hit by a missile just once, you die. Uh, let's go right here. Normal. And English subs. So, I'm gonna shut up now. Oh, him? Yeah. I know him. It's going to take a while. It happened years ago. Did you know there are three kind of aces? Those who seek strength, those who live for pride, and those who can read the tide of battle. Those are the three. And him? He was a true ace. He was a fighter pilot they called Solo Wing Pixie. He was a colleague of the man I seek. Ten years ago, there was a war that engulfed the world. The Belkin War. And in that war was a pilot who trailed across the sky and disappeared from history. He was a lone mercenary who inspired both fear and admiration. He is the man I seek. And so, with the words of Solo Wing, the curtain rises. It was a cold and snowy day. Yeah, remember the Belkins for Mace Combat 5, that whole war shit? This is what this game is about. Listen up. We have a situation on our hands. 
A major squadron of Belkin bombers has crossed our border, and it's making its way here, to Valais Air Base. Apparently, they intend to attack our base in an initiative to gain hegemony over the entire Republic of Ustio. Valais Air Base is our country's last line of defense. If our base falls, no one will be left to stop Belka from taking over Ustio. Your mission is to destroy the squad of bombers and defend our base. Belka's invasion must end here. Okay. Well, well, since this is a special new game, I already have everything, but let's come back up. Jesus, will you hurry up? We're gonna use this starter aircraft. Oh my god, not this one. There, there you go. This, this, okay, right here. And then as I play on, I'll pick something more, a little bit more advanced and all of that. You know the drill, right? You know the drill. Start with the F5. First one. Okay, there you go. Oh, there's Big C. You got this, my boy. For after all, what is a man in nature? Nothing in relation to infinity. I couldn't read it. Look at the mountains. <laughs> Music. Ah, oh, this is gonna be good. Especially after he's come by five. Now I can enjoy myself a little bit more. Let's see if I remember this. Is one missile enough? It is. Are you gonna... I saw you up there. There you are. Ah, I wouldn't count on that. No. Would this work from here? It does. Oh yeah, so... That's the, the new stuff about this game. These targets are neutralized, so... They're gonna try to leave. If you destroy these neutral yellow targets... You're gonna feel the bar towards the mercenary style. Which I don't see the problem, honestly. But obviously, like I said, if you want to get all the ACE styles, you have to replay the game and then play while, you know, you, you, you basically avoid destroying the yellow targets if you want to go towards Soldier and Knight. Because that, that's also how you unlock the special mission of the game. You have to complete the game in, in all three styles. So yeah, you have to replay the game a few times to get that. It's something that I, I was never a fan. Actually, I don't like games that make you replay the game a few times for that kind of stuff. I, mean, I never really... 
I was never really a fan of that. But in this one, this since this is a base mercenary run, but not really, you're gonna see me blowing most of this stuff. Which is what I'm here for. You got that? Because I didn't. I don't know what the fuck this is for. I mean, I do a little. Whatever. Yeah, you, you do whatever you want, buddy. started on that snowy day. My first impression was he had potential. Skip this as well. Thanks to you, Belka's attack on Valet Air Base has failed. Your efforts will not go unrewarded. Your actions may well decide who wins the Belkan War. I, for one, will be counting on you. Oh, thank you, sir. So yeah, right there is the style bar that I talked. So this one is already filled up all the way onto the the left. Ah, uh, well, no cutscene. I thought there was one cutscene here. Maybe it's only at mission three. But yeah, that was mission one of the Ace Combat Zero playthrough. I'm very much looking forward to replay this for sure. Oh yeah, I'll see you guys soon.